What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Jangs Away YouTube video. Now, I feel like this is like a broken record just continually over and over again. Please, if you're watching, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Uh, it really does help me uh, get pushed out to other people that might like my content. Uh, so, yeah, we have a 92 plus overall pack with our pink diamond skulls that we can use today to try and upgrade our grind squad. So this is the grind squad. Uh, if you don't know what all this is about, what I'm talking about, go back, watch a couple videos ago, and uh, you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. So this is a squad that I'm grinding uh, to try and upgrade. So at the moment, we have enough Pink Diamond Skulls to add somebody, a 92 plus overall, to this squad. Now, will they be good enough to make the team? Who knows? Uh, will they be, uh, you know, a top tier player? Um, hopefully, we'll see. Uh, but basically, uh, we're hoping that we pick up somebody really good. Preferably somebody maybe from like here, like a Paolo would be really good. Um, a Manu, I wouldn't mind a Manu, he'd be decent. Um, who from here? Miles Turner would be okay, I guess. Top of the class, who was in top of the class? I wouldn't mind a Jaron Jackson, even a Murray Stoudemire, Brandon Miller. They'd all be good, they'd all play for me. Um... Who's in this one here? A Carmelo Anthony definitely would. A Josh Smith would. A Tony Kukoc would. They definitely would play. So I'm hoping we pick up someone like that. Obviously, in these ones here, we've got people like Derek Coleman, Grant Hill, Latrell Sprewell, Kenny Anderson. There's a lot. There's a lot here that we could pick up. Like even here, you got like Jason Richardson, DeAndre Jordan. Uh, these are all guys that we would definitely take. Uh, Andre Wiggins would be good. Sean Kemp. Can you man? Like the list goes on and on and on. Anyway, uh, we're also adding somebody else to the team tonight. I think I've got enough skulls. It will be um, Homie Harkes. I think that's how you say his name. Hamey, Hamey, Homie, Hamey, Hamey Harkes. Uh, he is in the exchange as well. So we will pick him up. I think we've got enough to do a diamond skull. Yes, we do. We've got a few. So we can definitely do that. Uh, we'll confirm that one. That will get us another diamond skull. I think we already have enough diamond skulls, but um, I just thought I'd do that one while I was here. So we have, so I've, I put two towards the pink diamond shea. I probably shouldn't have, probably should have used them for this one. We've only done one of these so far, far the 92 plus, and that got us uh, the guy that was in our starting lineup, uh, Shane Battier, in one of the previous videos. So this one here, we need to add in three pink diamond skulls, obviously. We can just do it like that. So here we go, 92 plus overall premium pack. We'll lock this one in. This is our 92 plus overall premium card. Uh, we will go and pick up um, uh, ha ha Hamey. I think it's Hamey, Homie, Hamey Harkes. I think we do have, yeah, we've got enough diamond skulls for this. So we will uh, confirm Hamey, Homie. So we, he definitely will make the team, absolutely 100% will make the team. Uh, he is a really, really good card. If you haven't used him already, uh, go check him out. My mate's got him. Um, I've seen lots of people playing with him. He can shoot, he can rebound, he can defend. He, he, yeah, he's just sick. Um, so we also need pink diamonds for Eric Spolstra. We definitely do want to get this card eventually. But uh, yeah, obviously we can't right now. And we could do a diamond skull here for a season one super pack, but we won't just yet. We might use that uh, a little bit later. But anyway, let's go and open up our pack. We've talked about who we want. And then we'll upgrade our team. So right here, our 92 plus overall premium pack. Let's hope for someone good. Let's hope for someone good, someone that'll play, someone that'll get minutes. Uh, there's our diamond glow. Let's see if we can guess it. Let's see if we can guess. We always try to guess. Never got it, I don't think. Let's see who we get. So Western Conference, 92 driving lab. So it's a guard or a forward, I'm thinking. Small forward, Seattle. Is that... Hey, Desmond Mason. I'll take Desmond Mason. Desmond Mason definitely will make the squad. I have played with this card before. I nearly locked in this set. Uh, Desmond Mason is a bucket. He can throw down like crazy. Uh, and he's pretty quick, actually. So I would take Desmond Mason. He'll definitely make the squad. Uh, and let's go and update the squad here we go grind squad so i think 
Uh, Theo Ratliff will probably leave the team here at this junction. So obviously you can see I've got lots of other cards. Um, there's Desmond Mason, and I think Jason Williams will also leave the squad. Where does Harkers play? I thought he played... Do I not have it yet? I've got to go get it from somewhere. What position does he play? Does he play power forward? I might just missing him here. Oh, right there. Stupid me. Sorry. Uh, so, yeah. So, um, I believe... Desmond Mason will probably start at the two for us. I definitely think I like that speed, that explosiveness. Desmond Mason, 6'5". Uh, he has a 85 three ball, so not the greatest. Probably have to put a shoe on him. Um, but yeah, driving dunk, 97. Decent ball handling. Okay defense, actually. Pretty good defense. Good rebounding for his size. 90 speed, 88 speed with ball. So yeah. He's definitely okay. Uh, three Hall of Fame badges, obviously. Post Rise, the Aerial Wizard, and Pogo Stick, then 12 Gold. Uh, and then the Huckers, where are we going to put him? Small Fall, Power Forward. I think he's probably going to start uh, over English, I think. No, actually, you know what? We're going to put him in the starting Power Forward position, maybe? Let's just uh, do this. So I'm just flipping them all around here, obviously. So I think that there will be... Actually, we'll just move these two. That there is going to be the starting lineup. So Jalen Green, Desmond Mason, Alex English, um, Hame Hakez, and Carl Anthony Towns. Now, tell me if I'm saying that name wrong as well, by the way. Um, and then our bench is Tony Parker, Shane Battier, OG, Tim Duncan, and Demontis Sabonis then... Running our backup bench is uh, James Worthy, Obi Toppin, and Buddy Hill. Now, Obi Toppin actually has a case to be the main stuff, like backup power forward in this situation because he is really good. He's still a really, really good card. But let's go and have a quick shoot around with our two newest additions to the team. Uh, so, go over here, Training Hub, Freestar, and Start Game. So, yeah. Uh, We'll just make a sub here. Let's first start off with Desmond Mason because he's our, our random player that we got. Confirm that one. All right, so first we'll look at his hot zone. So no threes, no threes, obviously the midi. Let's see what his shot is like a three for his three ball. Hmm. It's a little bit long actually. You gotta hold it a little bit longer than you expect kind of like and when he's about to actually release the ball so yeah so it's like kind of yeah wow okay it's like really really late for what you expect like you expect it to be quick mainly because I've been shooting with a lot of other quick players if you remember that though it's pretty easy okay what's his dunking like should be pretty good yeah he yams it throws it down pretty damn hard um, I don't mind it. I don't mind his rim attack. Uh, and then, obviously, where he's going to be good is little pull up jumpers here in the midi. Uh, I think, man, yeah, you really got to hold that slightly early. You really have to hold that. If, oh, that one's slightly late. You really have to hold that. Okay, let's switch him out and let's see what Harkers is like. Uh, hot zones, wow, okay, so he's got a lot of hot zones. Okay, let's see what his jump shot's like. Everyone says it's good. It is good. It's very quick. The The difference between the two is is glaringly obvious in the way, in the speed and, and the shot. Harkez's shot is just so much quicker. All uh, right, let's see what his dunking's like. Oh, his layup, I should say. <laughs> Not bad. He kind of gets higher than you expect for a dunk that isn't necessarily crazy. Two hand, two hand rim grazers. Not really rim grazers because he's getting up. But he just he does like those those two handed dunks. Okay, let's run straight in and see what he gets. 
big one-handed tomahawk. Okay, uh, midi. Once again, same as his uh, same as his three. It's pretty quick. Moving shot. Slightly late. Okay, so it's it's quick as well. Okay, not bad, not bad. All right, so that is uh, the tools new additions to the team. Uh, I forgot to have a quick look at Harkos, Harkos here. So he's three ball, is an 87, so that's why he can shoot pretty well. Uh, at 6'6", six, six, though, running, mm, I might have to move him down to the power forward, uh, small forward position, because running starting power forward might be only good if we're doing a quick lineup. Um, what else are we looking at here? His driving dunk is a 95, so it is pretty good. Decent ball handling. Decent inside for as only, someone's only 6'6". Six, six. Really good rebound if someone's only 6'6". Six, six. Um, good steal, good defense, good block, good hustle, good speed, good speed with agility. I meant speed with ball and the end agility, good vertical. Yeah, really, really good card. Really, really good card. Um, so anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. Um, we will probably be able to add one or two more, probably only one more of those um, before the end of this whole thing, unless 2K change what they're doing with the uh, with the skulls. Um, there, there is meant to be something happening tomorrow, but I'm not sure. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and um, make sure you have notifications turned on so that when I go live, which I did yesterday, when you when I go live, it shows some no, uh, like gives you a notification, and um, that way you can jump into the live and have a chat with me, have a talk, and tell me what your team's like and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, thank you guys for watching and um, make sure you hit that thumbs up button or the like button, whatever it's called. Make sure you subscribe and um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.